I'm Storm Track 8 meteorologist Marcus Bailey. Thanks for logging on to WishTV.com and the Wish TV weather app. Really a nice day across central Indiana, and we're setting up for a very quiet but chilly night. 43 at 7 o'clock to 38 at 9 and 35 at 11. So you're going to see those numbers fall a little more quickly than past few nights. And it will be near freezing at the bus stop, but overall quiet to start things off for your Thursday morning. I think we get down to a low of 32, and that's where we will hold in the 7 and 8 o'clock hours as the sun comes up. Your daytime hours for Thursday will be dry. Numbers into the low 30s in the morning to 43 at noon. And we'll finish the day off only with a high of 45. And as we progress through, uh, through the day, you'll see those clouds on the increase. So bright blue sky early on, a little more overcast as we head into the second half of your Thursday. We've been talking a little bit about of a winter type system coming in for Thursday night into Friday. That still holds true. So I'm going to pick future cast up at 8 o'clock Thursday night. We are still dry. It's probably not going to start to show any signs of precipitation until well after midnight. I stopped this at 5 o'clock in the morning on Friday, and you're seeing a mixed bag of rain and some snow. Basically, along and south of I-70, it's probably going to be mostly rain for you. North of I-70, northern half of the state, you could get some rain and snow, and the farther north you go, you get, it could be all snow. And then eventually you'll get some colder air working in, and we get the transition completely to all snow, say around, oh, 7, 8, 9 o'clock. And the timing may fluctuate a bit on this. Again, extreme southern counties, though, you probably stay all rain. Not much in the way of accumulation here. And on the back end, second half of the day, we'll have some scattered rain, maybe some snow as well, and that will remain isolated through much of your Friday late afternoon and then heading into the evening as then the temperatures really drop and colder air funnels in for Saturday morning. In terms of snowfall accumulation, less than one inch. We're talking a dusting in many locations here. Grassy surfaces, rooftops, automobiles that are parked outside, uh, nothing on the uh, pavement. It's going to be far too warm for that to occur, so that won't be an issue. Friday, then again, you'll have that rain and snow mix in the morning, and then cloudy with that just isolated mix coming in during the day, and temperatures will be into the low 40s. Let's talk about some cold spells that are going to be heading our way. We get that first shot in this weekend. That will be following our rain snow mix for Friday, and then as we head into next week, Monday, we'll have another chance for a wintry mix. And that's going to usher in even a colder blast of air, more significant because it rushes all the way down to the Gulf states. They'll be talking about numbers well below average for this time of year. And the weekend is looking chilly. 35, the best that we can do for Saturday with a lot of sunshine. We'll call it partly cloudy and cool Sunday. A little warmer, but still below average with a high of 43. We're back to around uh, 44 on Monday with that wintry mix. And then the bottom drops out again. Tuesday 35, Wednesday 37, and back to the lower 40s next Thursday.